the place. Oh, you're just going to be so proud of your grandma. I finally stepped into the 21st century with the new lighting. Oh, CFLs. Well, and, uh, I like what you did with your old light bulbs, grandma. And I just have one of these new CFLs left. Um, just one more place, if you don't mind helping me. I just, it's so hard to, whoopsie. Oh no, I'll, I'll clean this up. Whoa, whoa, no, Grandma, don't go any closer. You can't just clean up a CFL, it has toxic mercury. It's okay, Grandma. I'll look up how to clean this up. Alright, the first step, according to the EPA, is to have people and pets leave the room. Okay, Grandma, the EPA says the next step is to pick up the glass and place it in a glass jar with a metal lid. Oh, I got one of those. Wasting my pickles to clean up toxic CFLs. Ugh. I got the jar. Finally, Grandma, the EPA says we have to throw everything away and wash our hands. Oh, I'm so sorry, Sonny. I thought you were going to be so proud of your old grandma for installing this new technology. It's okay, Grandma. CFLs just aren't the newest technology anymore. There's a better non-toxic way to save energy. You should use LED lights. They save more energy, they last longer, and they don't have any toxic mercury inside. Huh. I'll have to check into those new LEDs. But now that we're done with that uh, useless cleaning, why don't we celebrate by baking some cookies? Grandma, I can't stay. I've been spending all this time cleaning up the lights. I gotta go. <sighs> well, Sonny, hate to see you go, but what am I supposed to do with these leftover CFLs? 